powerful combination. Victory! Chaos Meteors Strike. Did I hear a squeak? Yo boys, it's your boy Merrick and welcome to another Perfecto Guide. So I know, I know, I couldn't make any videos because I couldn't manage my time to make guides or even to play Dota. But now I'm back, beach. So today I'm gonna show you how to farm fast and be efficient with the farm with all the type of heroes. So I'm gonna show you a lot of examples of how to farm multiple camps or triple camps even with heroes that are not even fast farmers. But before we start, I need to tell you something guys, I'm gonna do the things that I love in this channel, which is gonna be like this, I'm gonna try to make at least 4 videos every week, the first one will be Dota 2 guide of course, the second one will be a fun video that I'm just gonna make and I hope you guys will like it, the third video will be me playing another random game of your choice of course, the last one will be Dota 2 gameplay, and I will try to make it better in terms of editing and stuff like that. So if I made more videos, they're all gonna be like me playing the game and having fun with you guys. And perhaps one day I will do a vlogging if you guys wanna know more about me or if you guys are interested. And about the streaming schedule, also I'm gonna only stream once every week on both YouTube and Twitch. And it's gonna be on Friday at 1pm GMT time. And in, every, in the end of every stream, I'm gonna do a giveaway. And it's gonna be a special giveaway for the end of the stream and it's gonna be a long ass stream so yes you need to be there now i hope you guys will support me through this rough time because my channel is kind of suffering you know in this kind of month so i hope you guys will like it so with that being said let's get started now to clear things out i'm only going to show you how to farm camps and link creeps and give you the tips of how to be more efficient with your farm now every hero has their own skills that can help you to farm even much faster and that's exactly what we are gonna do for the day so let's start with something important which is how to farm the jungle creeps now there's something important that is called repositioning yourself while you are farming which means if you are farming a camp a and you want to farm camp b as well you will be kiting the creeps and repositioning yourself to close the gap between you and the next camp so you can actually use that like 3 seconds or 4 seconds to farm the other camps and it goes on. Now you may say like oh, 3 or 5 seconds that's nothing but if you combine that while you are doing it to every single camp you'll find yourself like saving at least like 30 seconds or 25 seconds something like that of your time and you can use that time to farm either more camps or even lane creeps. So to start with, for example, we have Spectre. Now Spectre is not a fast farmer by any meaning and you will be behind in terms of farm against a fast farmers. But you can reduce that time and catch up in terms of farm. Now we have two important things with Spectre, his Desolate and his Dagger. So usually with Spectre, you would like to farm first the small creep because you will deal a bonus damage to the big creep with Desolate because that's how it works. So if the last creep is alone, you can finish the big creep much faster. And let's not forget Spectre Dagger that will allow you to deal an AoE damage to the creeps. Now usually with Spectre, I would like to use my dagger to, to deal a lot of damage to the next camp. Like I can hit my camp in the same time the other camp. So I can actually farm much faster. Now also this Radiance can help you to farm much faster with any hero like Spectre, Blotsuka or whatever. So with Radiance, you can use the burn to connect two camps together and farm them in the same time. Now also the same goes with PL. You can also use your third ability to rush to the creeps to hit them with more damage and you can do it again when it's off cooldown of course. The same thing can be done to the next camp. And instead of just walking back, I will be using Doppelganger to jump over the cliff and charge to the next camp using even my first skill so I can deal a lot of damage and create even like more illusions to farm the camp much faster. And by doing that, I can even walk with my real PL 
to the other camp to farm it as well. So my illusion can farm the camp and finish it and I can farm the next camp. Also heroes like Medusa and Gyrocopter can allow you to farm triple camps in the same time, which is in the dire side and that's thanks to Medusa split shot and Gyro flag cannon. So that will boost your GPM and XPM by a lot. And we can do the same thing to any other two camps by just cutting the camps and positioning myself in a way where I can actually hit both camps in the same time. Now with Meepo it's a little bit different, you can farm much faster than any hero and that's thanks to his clones. If you have 3 Meepos, you can send the main one always to mid or small camp to farm them and send the other 2 Meepos to other camps and make sure to use Poof so you can finish uh, or do flash farm with Meepo. Also use an A command and press it on the next camp that will force the Meepo to walk to the other camp and farm it. And if you can even use the shift command which is holding shift and force on your meepo to farm the next large camp or even like three other camps. But usually I don't do that honestly because uh, that's lazy because I need to switch to the meepo with my hotkeys and I need to use proof on them. So I can at least farm much faster and I need to always watch my meepos because you don't want them to just die while you are farming. And that will actually boost your, uh, you know, your game sense by a lot and also how to flash farm with Meepo. So you guys can watch any pro player playing Meepo and you will understand how they are actually flash farming. Especially by even stacking the camps because you can finish the camps, the any stack in the game except the ancient stack with proof with Meepo by having only like 3 Meepos if you want. Now also heroes like Tinker can farm double or triple camps in the same time with his motion machine to boost your GPM. Now with Storm you can use your remnant to deal a lot of damage to the creeps and use your ult in the same position where you at to get the overcharge to kill the creeps much faster and you can also jump over the cliff or even to other camps but guys remember don't burn all of your mana and always buy clarity with Storm Spirit because that's recommended like heroes like Storm Spirit and also like uh, Queen of Pain you need clarity to farm much faster.
Now with Turtle Blade and Naga, here's that have a strong illusion. You can farm multiple camps as well with your illusions. If you are like if your illusions is like uh, strong enough, you can send each illusion to one camp. Where it's kinda it's not the safe camp that you wanna farm because the enemy might come to you and kill you. So you can use uh, like the main one to farm the big camp and use your double illusions to farm another camp if they are not strong. If they are strong, you can just send one to the lane, you can send one to the other camps and make sure to send it like to a close camp because they will die much faster. Now with Lycan, you have different options. You can summon your wolves and dominate a creep and farm with it in the jungle camps and send your necro unit to push the lanes or you can do the opposite. Or you can even just farm multiple camps with your units like with necro and with uh, other units like wolves and the uh, helm of dominator creep. Now the last hero is Monkey King, and he's similar to the other heroes. You wanna use your second skill to deal an AOE damage to the camps, and you can even like use your first skill to hit the next camp that are next to you, so you can deal some damage to that camp, and bring it to you so you can farm multiple camps at the same time, because you are more like semi-range, you are not kinda melee, I don't see fucking Monkey King as a melee hero, I'm sorry. So I didn't want to mention he other heroes like even like anti mage because you can just use your blink to jump from camp to camp and I didn't want to use even bat of fury because I want to show you that even you can far much faster without it. So guys it depends on the hero and how you approach the hero it's not only the hero it's even you using your brain. Like I can farm a lot of camps with Monkey King and be much faster. Even with Invoker I can stack and use my Meteor so I can clear it. Uh, there's so many ways to farm much faster and it depends on how you guys play it. So you can guys watch pro players or their streams and learn how they are farming with uh, some specific uh, hero that you like. Like Sniper or any other hero or Storm Spirit or whatever. So that's it for today, thank you guys for watching, I hope you liked the video and if you do, please like and share the video with your friends so they can learn how to farm much faster. This is Mark, see you guys in the next video.